hello everyone and welcome to the channel in this flow series today we will see how to create auto launch flow in salesforce so basically what is auto launch flow in salesforce in salesforce the auto launch flow launches when invoked by apex processes rest apis and more this auto launch flow runs in the background the auto launch flow does not require any user interaction it can be called from other sub flows process builders apex classes a shared schedule or platform events when we use the record trigger flow or a screen flow at that time in a screen flow we have a ui component like text boxes screen component and in record trigger flow when we create a record update record or delete the record that time the flow triggers but in at launch flow we need to only write a logic for a particular operation so here we will see when we can use auto launch flow in salesforce suppose we have a task to create a multiple flows and need the functionality that needs to perform by all the flows then we can use an auto launch flow as a sub flow that comprises the functionality required by the all flows then we can't use any ui component on this one it will just execute the logic and the, what the main use of this flow we don't need to create the same functionality repeatedly let's understand using this diagram we have a screen flow and a record trigger flow now the requirement is that from both flows we need to send an email so usually what we can do the one option is to send an email from both flows individually by creating an email action on both flows then what is the use of in this scenario for auto launch flow instead of creating an email action on both flows we can use auto launch flow as a sub flow on this flow we will create an email action and this flow we will invoke from other flows whenever we need so let's take an scenario we have a screen flow and record trigger flow now the requirement is that from both flows we need to send an email now we have seen the one option is to send an email from both flows individually by creating an email action from both flows now what we will do we create a auto launch flow and this auto launch flow we will use as a sub flow in screen flow and record trigger flow let's jump to the salesforce org so this is my home page to navigate the flow in a quick find box search for a flows then under the process automation you will get flows click on it now i have already created the screen flow for creating an account i am opening the screen flow now here you can see i have created a screen flow in that i have added a screen in the screen component i have added account name rating and account email then i have added the create record element here i have set the field values for the screen component to the account fields now what this screen flow will do this screen flow will take the values from screen component and create the account record now the requirement is i want to send an email whenever the account is created for that what we need we need two things the recipient email address and the email body so the recipient email address will be getting from the account record you can see here in the screen component we have a accountant email so from here we can get the email recipient address but here we need to create an email body so that to create a email body here you can see the toolbox then you need to click on a new resources in the resource type we need to select text template here i am entering a email template this is an api name you need to select as a view as a plain text then here we need to enter the email body so that the email receiver will know for what purpose the email has received so here i am entering a email body in this email body you can set the dynamic value how can we set the dynamic value for that here you can see the resource picker as you click on it you will get the account name what is this account name this account name is from a screen component so when we create a record from a screen flow that time we will enter a specific account name so 
when the email will send to the particular account holder that time his name will appear over here this message is to inform you that your account has been successfully created now i have created the email body then simply click on done now using auto launch flow there we will create action element for a sending an email and that flow we will use in this screen flow as a sub flow for that here i am saving this flow and then we will create a new auto launch flow to create auto launch flow here you can see new flow click on it then here you can see auto launch flow no trigger click on it and then click on create button now in this flow we need to create two variables to take a value from other flow that means here we need to create empty variable so that we can take value from a screen flows so we will create two resources email and email body for that click on a toolbox and click on a new resources then we are creating a variable for that in a resource type we need to select as a variable then enter a api name here i have entered the email in a data type we need to select as a text because we are storing email text values in the availability of outside the flow we need to select available for input then click on done button we need to also create the same variable for a email body select a resource type as a variable enter api name email body data type as a text then select available for input then click on done button now here you can see under the resources we have created two variables email body and email then we need to add an email action for that here you can see add element icon click on it and click on action in action what we need to do we need to send an email for that search for a send an email here you can see send email click on it then enter the label here i am entering account creation email the api name will automatically populate then we need to add a body so here as you click on include button here you need to select a created variable that email body as you click on it it will appear here and then in a recipient address list that also we need to include and here we need to select email so you might be thinking in this email body we doesn't have any text template or in this email we don't have any recipient address list so what is need for that so when we use this flow as a sub flow in a other flows that time that time we have created a body in a screen flow that screen flow body will assign to this email body and then we have a email field on a screen flow that email addresses will store in a this email variable here we need to add a subject here i am giving hardcore value account creation email test then simply click on done button now our auto launch flow is ready i am going to save this flow here we need to enter a label auto launch flow for account creation test api name will automatically populate then click on the save button now our auto launch flow is successfully created now we will add this auto launch flow as a sub flow to the screen flow i am opening the screen flow that i have created here you can see create an account screen flow i am opening this and here we have a created email template so this email template will assign to the email body that we created in a auto launch flow and this email field will assign to the email that we created a variable in a auto launch flow
now we need to add that auto launch flow as a sub flow in this screen flow for that here you can see add element click on it then under the interaction you will see sub flow as you click on it here you will see referenced flow so here only appeared the auto launch flows and we need to select which auto launch flow we want to use as a sub flow in this screen flow so here you can see auto launch flow for our account creation test that i created just now click on it then enter a label i am entering send email to account holder then here we will reference the auto launch emails variable to the screen flow variables for that we need to click on include and this email body variable which we created in auto launch flow here we need to assign the email text template to this email body then click on a email include button and here we need to add the account email this field is a screen component click on it and then and then click on a value that means it will catch the email value that we entering in a email then simply click on a done button now our flow is ready then simply click on a save button now i am going to debug this flow click on debug then click on a run button now i am entering a name test auto launch flow then enter a rating i am entering wrong here i am entering my email so that i can show you the received email then click on save button as you click on save here you can see all done go to the app launcher search for account here you can see the test data launch flow account has been successfully created as i click on it here i have entered the account name email and the rating so here you can see i have got an email with subject that i have entered then the email text template as i entered while creating email template variable it's also displayed the particular account name now we can also use this same auto launch flow for a record trigger flow this is the use of auto launch flow in salesforce if you like the video click the like button subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon to get regular updates thank you